Monroe County Commissioners say they hope a $50,000 investment saves the county even more money in the long run. They're putting new stretchers inside ambulances across the county. One paramedic tells me the new equipment will keep not only the occupants safe, but the staff inside as well. An empty firehouse isn't unusual in Monroe County. Crews are constantly responding to calls. Our call volume over the last several years has increased by about 20% per year. When they do, paramedics say working with stretchers like these isn't always easy. It's repetitive, people are getting larger, and we're going to need a little help to start preventing injuries to ourselves. Commission Chair Mike Bilderback says he's looked at getting new ones for several years and figured now is as good a time as ever for an upgrade. It was just a good time between the call volume and the uh, need to buy a new stretcher. To, it, was, it was time to do it. This is just a solid investment for both the EMS worker and then the safety of the patient. Matthew Perry, who wears multiple hats for the county, including paramedic, tells me when crews lift patients up with the manual stretcher, it can cause back problems or worse. He and Bilderback plan to get enough automatic stretchers, similar to what's in this YouTube clip, to deal with the growing demands and lighten the load for EMS workers. For three of them, it, we're, we're talking about 50000 and uh, some of that depends on the kind of warranty that we would uh, like to purchase. It's more than just a bed. It serves as a CPR platform, a moving platform, and your seat belts in an ambulance. A lifesaver, Perry says, will help lower the county's insurance. All of them have solid data on workers' comp-related injuries and claims and how it saves workers in the long term post-purchasing one of these stretchers. As of now, Bilderback says they haven't had many crew members call out because of work-related injuries, but he wants to make sure they make the investment as a precaution. He and commissioners are set to approve the purchase at their next meeting.